Hello my curious friends. Today in this video we will learn about uh, the important Greek alphabets which are used in uh, economics. The first one is alpha. Its uppercase is written just like as the uppercase of English alphabet A and its lower case is written like this alpha. The second one is beta. Its uppercase is like English B and its lower case is written as like this. Uh, this alpha and beta it is uh, used in economics, mostly used in uh, the Cobb Douglas production function, which is like as x equals to a l raised to power alpha k raised to power beta where alpha and beta represent the elasticities of labor and capital with respect to output x. The symbols are also used on other places as well. The next one is gamma. Its uppercase is like this and its lowercase is like this. Then the next one is delta. Its uppercase is like this triangle and lowercase is like this. Mostly this uh, delta is used to represent change in economic variables. It is mostly used in uh, when we show uh, that is multiplier equals to change in income due to change in investment. The next one is epison. Its uppercase is just like E and its lowercase is written as like this. And the next one is zeta. Uppercase is like Z and lowercase it is somewhat uh, difficult to represent. This is like this. It is uh, lowercase. The next one is eta. Its uppercase is like H and its lowercase is like this. This symbol is uh, actually used in uh, the formula to write debt weight loss that is dwl equals to minus times 1 by 2 neta s neta d divided by neta s minus neta d multiplied by t square into q by p where neta s represents the elasticity of supply and uh, this neta t represents the elasticity of demand the next one is theta its uppercase is written like this and its lowercase is like this and then is iota uppercase is like this and lowercase is like this and then kappa its uppercase is represented by capital K and lower lim uh, lower case is written as like this small k. Now this is lambda. Its uppercase is like this inverse v and its lower case is written as like this. This lambda is mostly used uh, in economics when we use language and multiplier. language and multiplier then this is mu uppercase is as capital M and lowercase is written like this this is nu uppercase is like this and lower case is like this now this is pi its uppercase is like this and lowercase is like this. Symbol pi is used on various places in economics.
it is used uh, sometimes to represent uh, the inflation rate and sometimes it is used to represent the profit functions in economics uh, like we say r equals to i minus pi where r is a real interest rate and this i is a nominal interest rate where this pi is uh, this is equal to or uh, this represents the rate of inflation thus we can say that uh, real inflation uh, real interest rate equals to nominal interest rate minus rate of inflation or we can say that pi when we represent uh, the profit function equals to total revenue minus total cost now this is rho its uh, upper case is like capital p and lower case is written as like this now this is sigma its upper case is represented as like this and its lower case is like this this upper case represents uh, the sum or summation we can say summation if we write like this summation of x square i runs to 1 equals to 1 runs to 5 this means is equal to 1 square plus 2 square plus 3 square plus 4 square plus 5 square this uh, sigma lower case uh, sigma it is mostly used in statistics to represent uh, the standard deviation deviation and mathematics this is used to represent uh, the angles and now this is phi its upper case is written like this and lower case is like this or like this now this is chi its upper case is like capital X and the lower case is like this and now this is psi uppercase is right like this and lowercase is somewhat same like this and these were some uh, important uh, greek alphabets which are used in economics thanks